Welcome to Elmwood Heights, a picture-perfect community where every lawn is manicured, every fence is freshly painted, and apparently every flower box is doomed. Overnight, vibrant petunias and cheerful marigolds across the neighborhood just gave up, wilted, brown, and dead. The next day, letters appeared in mailboxes, a crisp white envelope containing a $250 fine for neglect of property. The residents were baffled and angry. How could everyone's flowers die at the same time? Was it a blight? A weird weather phenomenon? One resident, Sam, wasn't buying it. Sam's a chemist, and his analytical mind smelled something fishy, or rather something chemical. He scooped up a soil sample from his own ruined planter box and took it to his lab. The results confirmed his suspicion. The soil was laced with a potent, fast-acting herbicide. This wasn't neglect. It was sabotage. But who would do this, and why? The HOA, with its suspiciously timed fines, was the prime suspect. To prove it, Sam devised a brilliant plan. He went full-on CSI on his own flower boxes, carefully sprinkling a special, harmless, traceable isotope into the soil. Think of it like a chemical fingerprint. If anyone tampered with his soil again, this isotope would stick to their tools and equipment, creating a glowing trail of evidence. A week passed. The neighborhood held its breath. Then, under the cover of darkness, Sam went on the hunt. He walked the silent streets of Elmwood Heights holding a handheld Geiger counter. As he neared the community's maintenance area, the device began to click, softly at first, then faster and faster. He pointed it towards the HOA landscaper's truck. Bingo. The truck's cargo bed and, most damningly, the nozzle of a large sprayer were glowing like a firefly on his screen. The isotopes from his flower box were all over the landscaper's gear. The next morning, Sam attended the HOA board meeting, not as a disgruntled resident, but as a man with irrefutable proof. He calmly presented his findings. The soil analysis the time-stamped photos of the glowing residue on the truck and sprayer, and the clear data readings from his sensor. He laid out the entire scheme, a deliberate act of destruction to generate fine revenue. The board president's face went pale. The residents in the room erupted. The conspiracy was exposed. The HOA was forced to reverse all the fines, change its policies, and hold those responsible accountable. It just goes to show... You should never underestimate a determined chemist, especially one who loves his petunias.